front of the closed off church, heavily guarded by police. They ask from the government to make more efforts to protect the Christian minority in Indonesia. The church was built in a predominantly Muslim neighborhood, not unusual in a country where 90% of people identify Islam as their religion. The fragile balance between religions here in West Java is being tested. Why don't they find a place where no Muslims live? This is a Muslim base. It's up to them where they want to build their church, just not here. Attacks against Christians are on the rise. In the past two weeks, a Muslim mob burned down a Christian center in West Java after rumors spread that a church was to be built. Christian organizations say 20 churches have been forced to close this year, compared with seven closures in the whole of 2009. Most of the attacks are being blamed on small violent groups like the Islamic Defenders Front. During a recent protest, some Muslim groups vented their anger at what they call Christian provocations. They blame Christians for posting anti-Islamic messages on the Internet. Emotions ran very high. If the government won't do anything to stop them, we will just burn their churches. testify that more and more people, including Buddhists and Muslims, are attracted to attend the Christian services. Pastor Billy Jotora Harjo has seen tremendous growth in his church. The congregation has increased from 400 to more than 6,000.